All right, we're on day three of our unit one. Okay, so it's government for the people. We're going to uh, talk about cause and effect, which we did a little bit of that already. Okay, so here, like, here's the cause. Okay, Rosa Parks refused to move from her seat, from her bus seat. Okay, what were the effects? What happened because for her to do that, Naomi? She got arrested. Yep. Okay. Yeah, she had to sit in the back of the police car. Okay. All right, now we're going to go to page 11 in the red book. Go ahead and get that up for me, please. Okay, and we're going to talk about more about cause and effect, and we're going to complete uh, page 11. Okay, it says uh, reread periods 13 to 15, which we did. Okay, page 11. Okay, page 11. It says, what happened after Rosa Parks refused to move from her from her bus seat? Complete the cause and effect. Okay, so it says that Rosa Parks refused to move from her car from her bus seat and was arrested. Okay. Then what happened after that? They did something. Sorry, right, I already said she got arrested, but what else, what else happened? Okay, keep going. Just keep going. It's not really about her, but what happened? Because of, the, of her doing that, something happened. Okay, there's, there's, what do the people do? Remember? Yes. It's called a one-day boycott. One-day bus boycott meaning hey they did that and they said okay for one day we're not going to ride the bus and that's going to cost money to all the people to the bus uh bus companies okay what happened after that okay she got arrested right okay so she was found guilty okay it's kind of sad. Rosa Parks is found guilty for not obeying the law. Okay. And then who came, who came to help her? Somebody famous came to help her. Yes, good. <coughs> Dr. King, Dr. King's group called, calls for a longer Bus boycott. Okay. Okay, cause and effect. So it started with Rosa Parks refused to obey, uh, refused to move from her bus seat and was arrested. Then a, a one day bus boycott is organized. Okay. She, she went to court. Okay, Rosa Parks is found guilty of not obeying the law. Then Dr. King's group calls for a larger bus boycott. So then African-Americans, and probably some other people as well, not just them, I would assume. African-Americans refused to ride the bus for 381 days. Okay, so then, yeah. 